pitcher, Seth Overby, just reached down at the last minute and redirected the ball to the second baseman. And now Romack swings away at an 0-1 pitch and a base hit into right field, scoring Angel Gonzalez. RBI single for Jamie Romack, who done so. The curve will do so in the next few days as Boone turns on a 2-2 pitch and hits it high and deep. Well hit, way back, get out of here. James Boone will circle the bases. A home run here in the second to add to the curve lead. It's now 2-0. The pitch, swing and a drive. Right center field pushing Tabata towards the right center field. Gap into the wall. He's not going to be able to get there. It is a home run over the right center field wall. The 375 marker, Brian Doe Parak goes the opposite way. And the New Hampshire Fisher Cats have cut the curve lead in half. It's now 4-2. to two hitting 90 or more on the gun. 1-2 pitch, fastball called, strike three. There's a 1-2 to Romack, hit high and deep, left center field, it's got a chance, Nielsen back to the track, tries to reach over the wall and it is out of here. Jamie Romack with a leadoff home run, he takes the turn again. Number seven in a curve uniform, number 25 overall. And it's now a three-run lead once again at 5-2. And here comes the 1-2. Swing and a miss and a strikeout. He got him, and that's a winner for the curve. The ball was in the dirt. Tag applied by Miguel Perez. Two and a third shutout innings for the save for Mateo. The victory goes to Yoslan Herrera. And the curve beat the Fisher Cats. 5-2 the final score tonight in front of 6,600 plus from BCB. The curve even the series, the rubber match tomorrow at 6.05.